We're going to like 35 euro a piece. Wait, wait, wait. Thank you so much, guys. That that really means a lot. Uh, it's a 13 minute walk. The other place looks nice. The outdoors. Because it's in the Condamine area of Monaco, which is okay. kind of that central... Is that on the way? or? Yeah, um, yes, it is. I oh. think... <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. No, it's the Kenny West. I lied. Sorry, oh. Stepa generously oh. handed you 2,500,000 euro euros and left the message. Here's some spare change for dinner. Share it with your friends. Question number two for a normal car. He should remember it. Ha ha, less than three. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much, Fred. It's two million euro. Two million euro. That, yeah, well, you know. That's it, guys. We're just going to go look at boats. And uh, I guess we can collab on the boat somewhere. Yeah. And just... Oh, yeah, the palace. And then we can go. Thank you so much. And yes, so much. and Stefa has sponsored the first postcard giveaway and one more postcard giveaway. And the question is, what are the people of Monaco called? It's going to be a fast one. <laughs> Do you know the answer? Uh, I, I, I think so. Obviously, I won't give it away. <laughs> well, we'll end you a postcard. <laughs> we'll go put it. Oh, we have it. Rich. <laughs> Rod Guru got it. Rod Guru, congratulations. Send your guest. Send us your mailing address to get a postcard from somewhere in the world. Monocast. Thank you so much. Monocast. <laughs> Monogam. Rich. <laughs> Rich. Thank you so much for playing, you guys. And thank you, Stepa, for the postcard. Thank you, Stepa. Thank you, Cecil. And thank you, Johnny. Thank you. It's really nice thank of you guys the, to uh, help us taking our, yeah, yeah. our thank you so much. friends out today to a yeah. nice uh, meal. Thank you guys. Amazing, guys. <laughs> What do you guys feel like eating? Or what do you guys don't eat? Or what do you guys eat? Or like... Uh, to be honest, mm. I, we're Are you hungry? Pretty, pretty flexible. Okay. I'm quite hungry. Um, I like... Okay. Yeah, I like anything. Really. Uh, obviously, with uh, Tallulah being vegetarian. Ah, uh, yes. True. God. No, no. You can uh, <laughs> story of my life. Because <laughs> I'm trying to figure out where we from, you know, that, like, we came from here. Yeah. yeah. If you want to go back to the roundabout, I. I it's that way, yeah. Yeah, because yeah. yeah, maybe there were things around. I don't know. Maybe yeah. I'm wrong. Yeah. I'm not sure. But the place that Crypto said Grubbers is right in that center. Uh huh. And maybe there's things there. Okay, let's, let's check that. Is it burger. It is burger. Uh, I think I know the shop. I think I passed. Uh, Apparently there is a really good burger place, yeah. Called? The place must have spicy Rocker? food. But we got someone in chat. So Cecile like, does follow you. <laughs> the place must sell spicy Cecil. food. Nadina has all her food with chili paste. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, you have a song. Oh, I do. Tea the party pooper. Oh, because I'm a vegetarian. I... Look at this. Look at this. That's the big fancy pier in Monaco. Johnny 360 Johnny 360 Johnny 360 <laughs> Johnny 360 We're just gonna do beautiful ASMR <laughs> panorama shot of Monaco Yeah, I think Espar said it was the densest population in the sea Well, they don't have much space for their citizens Johnny 360 Johnny 360. Uh, uh, uh. Guys, look. Johnny. Is that a swimming pool <laughs> a swimming in the middle pool. of nowhere? Come with the pier, I guess. You, uh, you know. 
No, I'm, I'm stuck between the HDMI cable, just. <laughs> Wait, I'm still stuck. Okay, we're good. God, that lighting. <laughs> yeah, because of the clouds. The clouds are so low and up those mountains there. I wonder whose pool that is. And he sees in the middle of, like, the street. That's, uh... In the middle of the street. That's the F1 track. Around this road here. Okay. The biggest private yacht on the med. Which one is that? Is on NC right now. Which one is the biggest uh, private yacht? What's the name? <laughs> Behind the scenes of a vlog. Oh, we've been spotted! <laughs> Chichi! <laughs> Dilbar the yacht. Dilbar is... Uh, is it an Goes Emirati? past all the yacht, past the pool, and right at Raskas. Oh, so you that's said... that's the F1 place you were talking but about. But is that okay price-wise, though? Because it, I think... We oh, got donation, but we have to be careful, even you know, because Monaco can be really expensive. But let's go down, and we'll yeah, see already. We're going that way, so. Like I'm sure, in a place with Monaco, you still have to be careful, even with 200. <laughs> Just to like, but I'm sure we can find a place that works. I have to say, the setting of that place is quite amazing. Maybe, yeah. God, that place got dead. Yeah. Like, it was so busy earlier. Dilbar is currently considered to be the biggest private yacht in the world with a length of 157 meters. Wow. Oh, that's a big yacht. Coming here, we Pri saw a uh, sailboat yacht A? Sailing yacht A. Sailing yacht A, and that was already quite... How many meters is I think that? it's 120, but it's a sailboat though, so yeah. Is it the, the three-mast? The weird three-mast one, yeah. It was right outside of Antibes when we passed. I would but we yeah, passed it. I think we saw it out, outside. It's giant. I'm still guys, one day. One day we'll be in a pier and we'll get invited by some rich people on the yard. One day I'll be like, oh that's your small boat, come for a drink and so can be yes. <laughs> Success. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there are some pretty nice big ones in there though. Already. I don't know. Mm? Keep your 50 million yacht. Give me like a 35 foot or 40 foot boat, <laughs> and I, we yeah. call it. We call it. A, that's it. We so can, you're not picky. We though. can stop there. No. <laughs> yeah. There is a guy on Instagram that does all his job. I think he's called the yacht guy. The yacht guy. And all he does is visiting yachts. He has million followers. He gets paid to visit and he gets post paid to visit of yacht. the big yachts. Wow. And he gets invited to the boat shows and the yacht like shows and things in Dubai. And for a few Even thousand he does a story boat. on that yacht. Yeah. Yeah. Like one yeah. He just gets uh, paid for a live stream on Instagram and God. Instagram. What a life. Like, yeah. how did he manage to get into that, like, all the boat shows without yeah, being a contacts. member of the yeah. club or whatever, and then just being there to be the Instagram Will the next boat have a boat thruster? If I could, definitely. Uh -huh. If I, yeah, I would love that. Many people say it's cheating. I say it's <laughs> great. <laughs> Honestly. Yeah, that would help. Docking and pier. And oh, somewhere. catamaran. You don't need a boat thruster then. Yeah. You just have that dual engine. Yeah. Would you guys sell on a catamaran if you could? Uh, I'm not that interested in that. Yeah? Mm. But, uh, I mean, yeah, if, the, if, <laughs> if, if, it, was, if it was affordable. And, By Randy. Uh, 
Yeah, yeah that's the money, yeah. yeah. It's a little bit often too much like a floating apartment. Yeah. And there is less of an adventure feeling. Yeah. But yeah, we're the same, like, you know, if we happen to get one, yeah. then sure, of course. Yeah. Yeah. Good night, night. Night. We're pretty flexible. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how, how good they are as sailors, I've never watched any. I think they can be quite, quite good, I think. Some model, I guess, right? Because there are some that still are good sailing ones, right? And they're really stable, so I guess yeah. for like seasickness, that's fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Less, less waves. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I guess they have their advantages, you know. Oh, Cecile, by the way, do you receive her emails? Yeah, did you uh, uh, like? Oh, I haven't checked. This, the, the, the thank you emails, them. do you receive them? Because we're, we're not sure. Good night, Roundy Sleepwell. <laughs> Oh, we walked? How many steps did we do today? Oh, uh, we passed our 10,000, I think. Uh, that's 12,900. 12,000, okay. Not, not bad. Normal, oh. average. Cheers, Cecil. Okay, good. Okay, cool, Cecil. Well, to be fair, we don't have a really big navigation tomorrow. We can go to bed quite late. Yeah. Do you, do you know what the weather's like tomorrow? We checked. The waves are a bit bigger, but like nothing 40 centimeters. Okay. And uh, no wind. Wow. So yeah. Yeah, I think average like six knots or something tomorrow. So. And we only have seven miles to do tomorrow. Yeah. So. Yeah. What is that? Two hours? No. Yeah. If we do it on engine, oh. an hour. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. At that point, we just want to get there. So. Yeah, and we're not even streaming it, so we're just gonna rush there. And you'll be doing the whole thing, yeah? Oh, I'm practicing. Yeah, you're tomorrow? practicing tomorrow. Okay. Oh, with waves. Okay. I'm chilling. Fine. I guess I have to practice. Uh, where are we going? Um, Do you know where oh we're going? My, okay, but are we going to that place? I, I am. Be, yeah, I don't know where. Which place we're going? Well, it's like a four-minute walk, and then that's the center. So okay, let's go see. You can go and check. Sure. Oh God, she's doing GPS. Is your is your arrow moving? Oh, guys, we're doomed. Look how she's using the GPS. Do you want to try this one? Please help the poor woman. Maybe I'll have a look where it might be. It's just like yeah. I, I think I know. I think I know where. Uh, I, I probably know where because we've been past here for like three times. Okay. So okay. So Nayana, Nayana knows by heart now. Okay. okay. Perfect. Okay, lead the way. Oh, I'm so glad we don't depend on Tallulah to find a place anymore. <laughs>